Hello, Professor Bee Wee here from Einstein's Entertainers with another science experiment that you guys can do at home. Now today, we're going to be having some fun with some magnets. Now you guys are going to need a paper plate, some paints, a safety pin or paper clip, and of course, crucially, a magnet. Now, if you watch with our magnets, they have two sides. They have a North Pole and a South Pole. Now, if I show you, if I place this little magnet onto my hand and I bring this other one closer to it, what will happen is the two opposites of our magnets will attract each other. Ready? Can you see how it flew up there? Now, this also happens with our paper clip or safety pin because the metal inside the safety pin attracts to the magnet. Now, ready? If you watch, you watch this safety pin on the table. Ready? It will fly up to it. Ready? Here we go. Oh, can you see that? Now, using this experiment, what we're going to be doing is we're going to show you guys how you can have some fun making some really cool designs on a plate using the experiment that we've just done. So, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to place your safety pin or paper clip into the middle of the plate and then place your magnet underneath your plate. Now, if you watch, when I move it around, we have, we can move it with a magnet underneath. Can you see that? And then what we're going to do now is we're going to use these three colours here. Red, blue and yellow. These colours all together, does anyone know what these are? These are called the primary colours. And that means that you can make any colour out of these three colours. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little block of colour onto each part of the plate. Ready? So I'll put the blue down. And then I'm going to put the yellow. And now I'm going to show you guys that when we mix these colours together, you can make different colours. So then what you want to do is you want to hold the plate up, hold the magnet underneath, and then if you move your magnet along, can you see how you get your colour? You can make different patterns. Now, I can see here that when we mix our yellow and our blue, we get green. And when we're mixing the blue and the red, we get purple. And then if we go back over and go through the red, go over to the yellow, we will get orange. And if you move it really quickly, guys, you can make lots of different patterns. So there you go, guys. That's our experiment for today. Now, if you've had fun, please don't forget to subscribe and give us the like button. And please do tell more people about these videos, because we want to keep more people busy during this crazy time when the schools are off. But guys, don't forget to keep safe and to wash your hands. See you soon, guys.